Hey, die. What is up? Good morning. White and shine. White and shine, y'all. Hey, it's Friday. And it's day six of Lawnmas. That means we're one day closer to Swiftman. I know many of you are looking forward to that. I want to say we're three weeks away. Yeah, that makes sense. Um, but I'm on my way to work. Unfortunately, I will. And so I just want to make an info for this vlog. Is it the day started? So I don't know what my plan is today. Um, I have no idea. Honestly, no idea. But before we did the day started, or your day started. If you are new to the channel, or you have not already done it, hit that subscribe button down below. Make sure you turn on that bell notification to be notified when I post the blog, blog myth, content for you guys, coming your way in 2020. Uh, give this video a big thumb up if you are excited to have one day closer to Christmas. And comment down below how your Friday is gonna be looking. Are you guys sleeping in, or waking up white and oily like me, or chilling with the friends, I don't know, let me know down below, what do you got? So, I will see you in the next clip, whenever that will be, so stay tuned, but before we go, I think the next clip is going to be a little bit of wind of dancing, how about that? <laughs> What is up? Uh, I just started like checking in with you. I'm at work. I got like 10 minutes before I got doing. Uh, so I'm just chilling in my tall listening to the, the music. You know, you did first thing in the morning. You can't tell what about that, can you? Absolutely not. Uh, I hope today though eat better, or what should I say, better? I am working with my best friend, so that's good. That would make the shift a little better. I know that would make whole shift a little better too. And, who knows? Uh, but, people really wanted it done then, this early in the morning, for sure. The people in the wife field. That's always great. When you, when you, when there are people in the wife who at this 30, or they've probably been here at 6 a.m., you know today's gonna be not that good. I mean, we're gonna get busy. We are the busiest Duncan in my area, unfortunately. We, all Duncan is the money maker for the owner. So they can be rich, white. Yeah, I don't know if I'm gonna leave that in. I might cut that out, but um, I'm just talking to myself right now. That's pretty much what I do. I talk to myself a lot. So why not just throw a hammer in my face and talk to a hammer? Make perfect then, right? Perfect. I'd be a, I'd be a good vlog to die, really. I have them. I have so many ideas 
coming your way, you have no idea. Like, so many. The problem is, I need people to, like, dumb, dumb activity need more than one person. Or some need more than four people. But finding those type of people, I can find one, I can find two people to help me. But finding more than four, put that about it. They are like, oh, I don't want to do that. That's the society we live in. Even though we're all on social media. So we're already all, we're already on the internet. So why does it matter? Or why do you take people's judgment to your opinion? Like, like for blogger, like you can ask any blogger in America right now or in the world and they would say the same thing. When they blog in public and they're walking down the sidewalk with a camera like that, they all would say, oh, people are staring and just like, why are they talking to a camera? Like, it's those type of people that make people just in that stuff. Like, am I doing the right thing? Like, and then they pretend to act normal, but in reality, that they try to hide the fact that they're talking to a camera, they're talking to their viewership. But really, we gotta just think, tell ourselves that it doesn't matter what people think. If you wanna do something, you do it. Don't let anybody th have the, they can think whatever they want. If you're happy, make sure you're happy. That's all that matters. And if you have good friendship, that even a better plus. Have good friendship that support you. That's true. So those are the two big things. Other than that, just be yourself. Oh, uh, hey, Dai. Uh, I'm just shutting in. Uh, I'm on break. I got another five hours to go. Yippee. Um, but I'm going to show you what lovely New York is have, having today. Why? Why? Why can't it just go away? Oh, right, I'm going to show you right now. We're supposed to get one to three inches of snow today. Look at all that flush, flush, and all that fantastic. Hey, Dai, I'm just shutting in. Um, I just got home from work. And now I gotta take care of three dawn. Three crazy dawn. So that's what I'm gonna be doing. Um, yeah. Definitely. Yep, yep, yep. What do you want? Hey, hey, hey. The crazy, the crazy. Um, and, um, what do you want? You're interrupting me. They don't tell. They want attention. So, yeah, that's pretty much what I'm going to be doing. Yeah. Taking care of these crazy pot, mutt, puppy, whatever you want to call them. I thought they'll take care of another one too. So yeah. Look at these crazy mutt. Yeah, look at yeah you I'm talking to you. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. 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 Yeah, I'm talking to you. Oh yeah, I'm talking to you too. Yeah. Oh you yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Hey Dai. Another shut in. Um I'm home for now to tell free dog they're all set, they're all good. Um, then I don't let the third one out around 10, and then she should be dead for bed. The other two should be dead for bed too. Uh, yeah, they're pretty much, you know, all that good thing. Uh, but until then, um, hit. Oh, already seven o'clock. Like, where the hell did the day go? Who knows? Um, I know this is gonna be so short if I just did a vlog. So I'm gonna add week fifteen of college football action winner and loser of who I think gonna win. So, and actually, there's not a lot of college game on this weekend. 
because most team uh it it didn't slow to the end of the season for Tyler Fall. And so uh, when it did slow to the end of the season they go uh, right into like the they start planning out playoff and bowl game and sadly my team lost last weekend. And then her rival, Auburn. Um, it wasn't as bad at LSU when we lost to them a couple of weeks ago. Uh, but honestly, looking at the highlight, we should have won that game last weekend. Alabama should have won Auburn in the Iron Bowl. Bowl. Um, we literally missed a field goal in the, inside the last two minutes of the fourth quarter. So that's what hurt us, that's what got us. Not good. Um, but, yeah, but sadly, we're not in playoff like we are every single year. Um, or what you were about to be. I know a lot of people are happy about that, but I'm not. I'm kind of sad. It's been, um, tough. It's been weird. We're most likely going to be playing in the Shizzle Bowl, and that's not a good bowl to play in. Or should I say that's not a good bowl that we are used to? Absolutely not. Um, but... Ah! I'm pissed. But I, what's been keeping me up to it is basically my friend and... Buffalo Bill. Buffalo Bill been keeping me a little more happy. But Ellie, one of my team is probably gonna be in playoff, most likely. That's good. But it's sad that we're not in playoff. It's really sad. But off of that team, off of my team, and let's go back to who playing this weekend. So, to start it out, it happened tonight at 8, so we're in 40 minutes, it would be on. Um, you got Utah versus Oregon. Now, Utah, I'm telling you, every football team, every college football team in Utah this year, been doing amazing. Same with Iowa. So, with that being in mind... I think Utah going to beat Oregon tonight, by far. Yeah, of course they're going to beat Oregon. Then we head into tomorrow, which this video will be live for tomorrow. We did it thrown up tonight. You got Baylor versus Oklahoma. Now, this is going to be a good game. I'm not going to lie, this is going to be a real good game. Um... This is going to be a real good game. But if I had to predict somebody to win, I try to send my team out. And we're most likely going to be playing the Super Bowl. I kind of want to see Baylor make an upset than Oklahoma. Like, I feel like Baylor can do their job. If they do their job, they can win this game tomorrow by fall. And then another game tomorrow. Oh, I, I think it's any tomorrow or Saturday. That's right. Is L.A. LaFell, I think? Of an app date. Now, this one is a clear answer to me. I know he's going to win this one. This one's going to be app date. Because if you've been following them, you would think, oh, they're not going to win. They're not that good. No, they were blowing out their opponent, like, Almost every other week or everything the week. They've been doing like 52 touchdowns. Like, I mean, yeah, 52 touchdowns. Uh huh, that's gonna be a. That, that right there is gonna be a Western. What am I talking about? I mean, 52 points a game than all the opponents. So I think App State can win that one tomorrow. Then we go into Cincinnati and Memphis. Now, this one did a little tough. Because you have Cincinnati, good football team, I'm not going to lie. And you got Memphis, and Memphis is 
all white, but tend to use a little more practice. It's gonna be a good game. It's gonna be a tight game, but I think Cincinnati's gonna come out on top by maybe a touchdown. Then you got Georgia versus LSU. Now, like I said earlier, LSU beat Alabama pretty bad. I'm still upset about it. Uh, but, so, for that being said, I don't want LSU to win. But I don't want Georgia to win either. But I would rather have Georgia to win over LSU. Then we go into Hawaii but Boise State. Now, Hawaii... They do some good football, but can they beat Boise State that has been playing amazing this year? I don't think so. So, with that being said, I think Boise State's going to win. Then we got Clemson vs. Virginia. Now, my preference is I want Virginia to beat Clemson. Will that happen in reality? I don't know. But do I want it to happen? Yes. Do I, I think that I, I want Virginia to make an upset here and beat Clemson. Um, Clemson have not lost yet. Alden, they're undefeated. They're probably the only college team undefeated right now. Actually, I take that back. I think they're one or two. And then the last team of this weekend, football, college football action, is Ohio State versus Wisconsin. Now, if you talk about any game this weekend that is actually going to be a good game, it's going to be this, this one, tomorrow night at 8. Um, Ohio State good. When Taunton is playing pretty good football this year, this going to be slow. Even though Ohio State is number one and when Taunton is number eight, but in reality, that does not matter. That's just number. It's about who come out on the field and play good football. And to think about it, I say, I don't know. I want Win to do an upset, but I don't know if they can take down Ohio State. Win Thompson is good, but I just don't know if they can have enough. Like they would have to, Win Thompson has to go out there and give it a hundred percent all to beat Ohio State. But there's a potential that it could happen. So I'd have to be with D.I. in reality. Alright, so that is all of week 15. Talent football action. Um, not many talent football teams this weekend. We did, again, talent football season is wrapping up and talent basketball is starting up. So it's in that transition stage of like playoff and pole bowl, and uh, bowl game. I know we all love those bowl games. So, we're in that area. There are not many college football games this weekend. If you look at one of the other videos that I did. But, yeah. So, I think I'm going to end the video there. So, I can edit it and then up before I still let the other dog out one more time before bed. I am going to tell you. So, I think I'm going to edit, end it. And... I thought I did it and did it up within the next hour or so. So, I hope you guys enjoy the day of Lord Myth. Did I even say that today? I don't even mind. It's been a long day. I have no idea what I said this morning. I just have to find out soon when I edit it. <laughs> but I hope you enjoy the day of Lord Myth. I hope you enjoy your Friday. Happy Friday. Or should I say happy Friday night instead of Friday night? I hope you all doing something fun or sleeping and or touching up on sleep or something like that. So something, just do something. Um also have a good thought to your weekend. If you have a weekend. I know I don't. And with that, I would say Make sure you find your magic moment, guys. You are worth it. And believe in yourself. Be yourself. Just be yourself. Believe. Believe. 
have that mindset. With that, we will see you tomorrow in day seven of Vlogmas. And remember, find your magic moment, y'all. Peace out.